Well, hey, me, Axe. Welcome to the video. In this video, we're going to be continuing on Pokemon Sun. One look. In the previous episode, we went ahead and we took on our last member of the Elite Four. We've now defeated all Elite Four members. And we're going to go ahead up to the champion this episode. Before we do that, I think we do, we'll do a team recap. You know what? You're flashing down there, Rotom. I see you. What are you going to give me? Why not start from a episode like this? It's the Roto Stealth. Well, that's not going to help us right now. Oh, Roto catches? My bad. I didn't know that was a thing. Roto catches? Holy crap, that's awesome. Uh, that's going to make shiny hunting a lot easier. And, like, just everything. Catching legendaries in general. Uh, anyway. Uh, let's go ahead and do a team recap. I will do it this time. Because we did have a loss in the previous episode that breaks my freaking heart. Anyway, we have 1, 2, 3, the Doug Trio on level 61 with Thief, Iron Head, Earthquake, and Stone Edge. With the Sand Veil ability holding that X, Burnt Belt. Ah, excuse me. I have Vic Vault on level 61 with Thunderbolt, Air Slash, Bug Buzz, and Flash Cannon holding that quick lock. Because this dude, he's slow. You know? He levitates. He can avoid Earth moves. Earth ground moves. Why do I keep saying Earth? I think Earthquake every time. Anyway. Whew. But he's slow. He's slow. He needs that. He needs a quick lock. We have... Random symbols. We have slide, half a H, and square. The muck on level 61 with flamethrower, sludge wave, toxic, and crunch with a gluttony ability, which will never come into play. I can guarantee it. Uh, holding that poison bar for that boy, that boy did, that boy did. Uh, sludge wave. We have cloister level 60 with protect, shell smash, icicle spear, and rock blast with the skill ability with them for them powered up icicle spears and the rock blast. And of course, the nerf melt ice boosts up icicle spears as well. We have decidueye level 60 with spirit shackle, leap blade, grass not for them heavy Pokemon, and acrobatics with the overgrow ability not holding an item because it has acrobatics. And we have our fallen member of the team, Sylveon, who got taken out. By a freaking something. Gigalith? It was Gigalith, right? Got taken out by Olivia, nonetheless. I said it wasn't meant to be. I said we weren't going to have... I literally said from the beginning. Like, I had bad experiences with Sylveons. Sylveon and Sunmundalock. Didn't make it. Didn't make it this far. This one made it further. Maybe next time we use a Sylveon, it'll make it to the very end. This one just missed out on the champion. Just missed out on the champion battle. As you guys might know by now, it is my belief that when you do a lock... The Pokemon that you lose along the way, their spirits are actually just trapped in the PC until you beat the champion. Or in this case, Kukui. Or maybe not Kukui, I don't know. I'm still predicting how it's going to show up. And they, yeah, they're not freed until you beat the lost, whoever it might be. Whoever it is after Elite Four. And I think, right now, I can hear some spirits being released. Ah, uh, yeah. What this one must fail to realize is that this isn't actually the end of the series. So doing a death montage right now wouldn't make much sense. So, um, back to it. All right, no more delays. Let's go ahead and take on... Whoever it might be. Uh, waiting for this chair. I'm gonna go wait. Who am I leading with? Do it. Does it matter who I lead with? I'm gonna leave with Muck, actually. Yeah, I am. Um, hang on, if I'm predicting how, if I'm predicting how, and I and I chose Poplio, uh, he'll have he has he has Toracat. Shoo! Wait a minute, I did not. Oh my my fire weakness is looking pretty dangerous right now. Oh dear. Oh dear. Did not think about this. I guess it's gotta be how. Do I have a water type move I can teach? No one could learn Skull. I think I've been over this already. Can teach Muck Rock Toe, maybe? I also use a lot of uh, Ethers and Elixirs, by the way, if you uh, did need to know. Uh, but it... I think we can get rid of Toxic. Because I don't know how, how much the Toxic, the toxic Stall. It's going to come into play here. I don't think Toxic is going to come into play, so we'll get rid of Toxic. We can always reteach a Toxic later. I'm scared now. <laughs> now I'm scared. I got rid of my, my get out of jail free card. All right, we're leading with Mark, right? We're leading with Mark. I'm paranoid. All right, so if I am right, and we are going to counter how, he'll probably lead with Incineroar. Or he won't, because he's a dick. Hey, really? It's Kikui? Are you here to... 
bring Hal in, maybe? Oh yeah, now you're the Pokemon League champion! Oh, finally, well, that's simple, right? Wouldn't it be nice if that's simple? The truth is, there's one more person you need to battle if, that, if you want that title. Is it gonna be you? Oh, really? Really, dude? And of course, that traitor is me! Woo! Just kidding! <laughs> the fake out! The fake out! I freaking knew it! I knew it! You already did it! You already beat Kakui, didn't you, How? I freaking called it! It's a me, How? You know what? Something kind of hit me after I finally beat my old grabs in all that serious battle. You're kind of my hero, Dasmo! Whoa. <laughs> we did not do anything to earn that kind of praise. You and your team are, I mean. I'm a cause, I really look up to you. I want to have a serious battle against you. I really want to be, yeah, because he was saying this the whole time, let's have a serious battle. Yep. Because it's way more fun when Pokemon and their trainers are all friends and get along. Then they can do something really amazing. It's our rival. After all this time, it's our rival once again. They really did want to like capitalize on the the red and blue nostalgia this time around, didn't they? Hey, look at how he looks focused and ready. My boy, how's taking it seriously, and he's leading with Raichu. He's leading with Raichu. I should have led with Doug Trier, which I think is who I was leading with before I switched. I'm going to mock. Uh, we do have Crunch though, so that's all good. You're gonna Thunderbolt me. You can live this. Mock's got this easy, easy stuff. Got the freaking power. This asshole got the freaking power. Do I have full restores? I'm pretty sure I have full restores. Oh, we took out one hit. I was not expecting that, but I should have been. I should have been expecting that. Tauros. I wonder why you're putting Tauros in. Have Earthquake? Can Tauros get Earthquake? Uh, why don't we? Simply put Decidueye in. Because. Because, 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 because... It's a ghost type, and I'm gonna put it in, because it's a ghost type. Ah, uh, that means he can't hit his normal type moves. It also means we can't hit him with ghost type moves, but who needs ghost type moves when we have that leaf blade? Am I right? Did I say leaf blade? I meant grass knot. Because <laughs> that's special, and we just got our attack lowered. Iron head. You're gonna go for the flinches, my boy. You're gonna go for the flinches. How about we just try that again, shall we? Can not go for the Iron Head again? Zed Headbutt. Avoided the attack! Go to the way. I mean, you got flinched, but then you avoided the attack, so it all balances out, right? That did about half. I'm happy with that. Uh, let's keep going for the Grass Knot then, I guess. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Zen Headbutt. Come on! I can take it, I can take it! I can take it! Can we take him out? Get a high roll? Not quite, not quite. That's not how Grass Knot works, I don't think. Uh, we need to heal, because he's going to outspeed it. I don't want him to pull any... Any nonsense on us. I guess we use a max potion right here. We got 40. There's no reason not to. I really shouldn't. You're withdrawing in for Incineroar. Oh, that's cute. That's pretty cool. He put an Incineroar against Decidueye. What a cool dude. I just realized Incineroar counters. counters, um. Decidue by twice, with fire and with dark. Can the same be said for fairy? Yeah, he does. Huh. Never even thought about that. But then it's not completed, because ghost isn't super effective against fairy. Well, I, I think, pretty sure I went over this, like, in the very first reaction video I did to, uh, to Sun and Moon. Anyway, that's so close. Came so close to being a full circle there. A full double circle. Anyway, uh, we get out of there. That's what we do. So we go for a dark type move or a fire type move. He's physical, right? So I think we put in Cloyster. Yeah, Cloyster got Rock Blast too. Yeah, yeah, let's do that. Come on back to Sidjuai. You got fully healed. Now get on out there, Cloyster. Cloyster, you gotta eat whatever you. Ooh, maybe I spoke too soon. Uh, I forgot you had that. It's fire one. It's not, it's not the signature one, but the fire one. Interesting. Uh, I think I just lost Cloyster, because that's going to be neutral. Because it's an ice water. You got this, Cloyster? My boy got it! My boy lived it! My boy, Cloyster. Uh, Alright, we go for Max Potion. Actually, we can go for High Potion. We can just go for High Potion. Where them Hyper Potions at? There they are. It's gonna heal. 
Getting nice and healed. Brr, now, will a Rock Blast. Will a five hit Rock Blast. Flare Blitz. Really? You want to do the recoil? Do you not see what I just lived? Nothing. You got nothing on me, boyo. Nothing on me. Uh, maybe there's something else. Maybe she can protect? I don't know if I want to. <laughs> Shell Smash. That's asking for death. Uh, yeah, I go Rock Blast because I'm pretty sure Incineroar is pretty slow if I remember right. Yes! Alright. One. Oh, no, you're going to leave that. You're going to leave that well and truly. Yeah, I should have expected that. Tully evolved. The starter. Couldn't have got just one crit off, maybe? Alright. Flare Blitz. Just need to live this and we're good. Live this and we are good. Oyster. Boy. You had one job. So that was a low roll, high roll, I guess. Ah! That's very annoying. That is very annoying. I'm pissed. I'm pissed. That is my freaking fatal flaw. I get too comfortable when, like, a Pokemon uses the move and it doesn't do half. And I get comfortable and I get cocky and... Ah! Uh, well. Close to this really well. Where the fuck is the speed? There we go. The true speed is 120. What? The chair is insanely fast. We don't. We can We got speed. We got speed. All right. <laughs> we got to outspeed it because otherwise I'm pretty sure we're going to die to a flare blitz. But then he'll take himself out. Not worth though. Uh, let's go for earthquake. We got them PP boosted. Yep. Maybe we should just land with this. Nah, there's no way. No way. I don't think Earthquake could take it out. We are one down. One down to his how many? That was his ace too. He sent Taurus in. Against a steel type. That's interesting. I wonder what it must have earthquake. Because Dugtrio is also weak to uh, ground, I mean. So you definitely have something like that. Uh I'm onto you, how? I'm onto you. I'm onto your earthquake. Come on back, Dugtrio. Get on out the decidui. Back at it again. Once again. And intimidate him again. Well, we're just gonna go. We're just going for Grass Knot anyway. <laughs> of course you did! Of course you went for a full store on the freaking Taurus and not Incineroar. I'm not complaining. That Incineroar is dangerous. If I did if it had lived that earthquake, I don't know what it would have done. Honestly, if you'd healed it up instead. No flinches for us this time around. Can we get a crit? Take it out. Take it out. Nah. All right. All right. Go for another grass knot. We got this right. Just gonna try to flinch me. Try to flinch me out, boyo. Don't do it. Don't do it. Ah, he did it. How much damage is flinch me doing? I want to take the risk. I do. I'm not going to though. I'm not about the risk life today. Not not today. I'm gonna high potion you up. At least now I can't get flinched. Can't flinch me if I don't attack. Yeah. Eat it. Oh, uh, yeah, you probably would have died. How much did that do? That yeah, was like 50. Yeah, okay. Probably would have probably lived, but oh well. Didn't want to take the chance. There's always a chance for crit. Now watch the flinch happen again. Hey, what was I saying? What was I just saying about the crit? It was one turn too late. One turn too late. That's a dead Taurus right there. Who's coming in? Crabominal. Why would you not send him in? Oh, I guess you sent Cinderor instead. Um, fighting ice? We ain't got no fire. We ain't got no fighting. We ain't got... We do have flying. We ain't got no psychic anymore. We ain't got no steel. We ain't got no fairy no more. Well, we do have steel, actually. And our steel and flying are both on the same Pokemon. Actually, Decidueye has flying, but I'm not going to leave Decidueye in. Because that would be ridiculous. Because Vikavolt also has flying, even though Vikavolt's really slow. What's he sending in again? Crabominal. And like, do bug and ice interact? I don't think they do. Did I make a boo-boo? Did I make a boo-boo? Where is bug on this thing? Bug and ice do not interact. Okay. I don't know why I thought. I think maybe because he's flying. I thought, you know, it's a flying type, so that interacts. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna use an S slash. St oh, yeah, Stone Edge! Okay, we lived it. I was, I was expecting to die just then. So anything less than dying is okay with me. Okay with me, bro. 
just fine. Just fine. Um, now what do I do? I could put I could put muck in because it has the freaking wait. Poison's weak to rock as well, ain't it? No, it's weak to ground. Poison's weak to ground, not rock. Uh, so I could put muck in. Muck should be able to live anything a Corbominal throws out. Uh, and again, maybe not. I could be wrong. Let's check Vikavolt's defense stat. Its defense stat is 137. And Mux is... 109. How much? Not super effective. We're gonna be fine. We're gonna be fine, and we're gonna use the full restore so we get the health and the power off. Watch him use Earthquake. Watch him use Earthquake now, Stone Edge. We're good, we're gonna eat that. Just don't create my fine. That's my boy. That's my muck. You're a good boy. I was a bit worried, I'm not gonna lie. I was worried about the crit. We have a four saw. We have 17. We good. Muck, catch this heal, my pal. Whew, okay, now we're gonna use Earthquake. What did happen? Ice Hammer. Was that like a signature move from Chromominal? I don't think I've heard of that before. We should not speed it now, if we didn't already. Flamethrower, let's go. Yeah. Just, if we had missed, that would have been dead mock. But what else are they gonna do? Just keep healing? No. Not in this playthrough. Not in this one to look. All right, who's up next? How many Pokemon have we gone through? How many Pokemon have we gone through? We've lost two, we got a Noivern. That's pretty cool. We've lost, no, we've lost one. This battle, right, I was thinking we lost Sylvia on this battle, we didn't. Noivern is a flying dragon. Ice would be great, but we don't have it. Ice would be great, but we don't have it anymore. Ice would be great, but we lost Cloyster. Ice would be great, but we don't have it anymore. That would have been a dead Noibat. One hit, that's all it would have taken. Noivern, I mean. Uh, what are we gonna use then? Flying dragon, rock. We got rock. We gonna rock this Noivern, know what I'm saying? Ice and Fairy would've been great right about now. And that's what we've lost. We've lost an Ice and we've lost a Fairy. We still have some rock moves on Mark. What else, what else, what else? Uh, Dragon, of course, we don't have any of that. <laughs> yep, that's, that's it. Gotta use Mark, cause he's got the rocks. Uh, actually, Dr. has rocks too. Dr. has Stone Edge, and he's got the extra belt. Uh, it's also ground. Uh, and he's flying. I don't think he's gonna have anything that's gonna be super effective against Dr. Trier. So come on back, Mark. You've done your work. You're good, boy. I think we're good. I'm just worried he's gonna have, like, flamethrower or something. That's what I'm worried about. Let's use a stone edge. Let's see it happen. Super Fang. Just straight up taking out half my HP. Alright, at least we know that can't- At least we know that can't KO. What if? What if it could KO? What if like... Should I heal? Should I heal? What if Super Fang could crit and it takes out your full HP? It's just an instant KO. OP! Uh, I'm gonna heal, because I don't want to take any chances. I'm sorry if that's boring- Ooh, you used a full restore. Look at you. So we're both taking this turn to heal. Look at us, just a couple of healers. Healing up our mons. All right, gonna go for that Stone Edge again. Doesn't Stone Edge have a chance to crit? Yes, come on, let's crit it, let's crit it. Really? Jeez, that did a lot. I was not expecting that. Crit! Mom, why can't you just crit? Uh, he outspeeds us, and that did more than half. Mm. Um, I'm gonna heal again. Should I heal again? I'm gonna heal again, because I just wanna see if it goes something different. I know he's just gonna do the same damage again, presumably. I'm a bit worried. I don't know what I'm gonna do. <laughs> Can't you just miss? Uh, so you're gonna go for dark type move. I can put muck in. Muck will live it. Does dark resist dark actually? Now that I'm thinking about it, it does. Dark, dark, dark does resist itself, so we should be fine. Because muck has a pretty high special defense as well. So you're gonna go for Dark Pulse. You're not gonna switch your move. You're not gonna be a dick. Come on, come on. Yes, you got this, Muck. You got this. You're gonna heal more, more than you just took. 
I know, you know, that's not how it works. <laughs> it doesn't heal this turn. Right, um... M -m 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 Max Potion, let's get this mark nice and ready. Nice and ready on that 223 XP! Come on, come on. Dragon- ooh. Look at you with your Dragon Pulse. We good there, right, Mark? Yeah! My boy! My boy, Mark. Ain't no one fucking with him. Rock Tomb! Get dead. Get dead. We got this! We got it! I think we got it in the bag. What's his last Pokemon? What's his last Pokemon gonna be? What would- what would Hal have? He's got- I feel like I should know. I feel like there's an obvious one that he hasn't used. Incineroar? Yes! Right, the Eevee! He had the Eevee as well, the Eeveelution. Leafeon! Well, we're gonna stay in on that, aren't we? Whoo! Boy, you put in some work, Hal, but we only lost one Mon. We only lost one Mon to Hal. I'm assuming that we won. Awfully presumptuous of me. Get the Smack Potion, get healed up, Muck. What is a Leafeon to a Muck? <laughs> he's really, he's really plucking at straws now, lowering my, my little my attack. Trying to charm me into winning, well. Catch this sludge wave, Leafeon. Oh, he's really going for it. He's really going for the lowers. But I'm sorry. Uh, you might die. You did die. Bye bye, Leafeon. And that is a wrap, ladies and gentlemen. I hope. I'm assuming. Is he crying? Did he cry? Oh, come on. How? We're just having, just, your buddy's having fun. We gotta keep moving forward by staying with full power at all time. We got stuff. We got stuff for winning. Woo! This is it for the main story, I guess. We managed to pull off some pretty amazing. Something pretty amazing. We managed to pull off something pretty amazing. When my partners and I were all in sync and wanting to do the same thing. You did. You put up a, you put up a fight, man. But it looks like we're still one step away from being the strongest trainer in team. But you know what's funny? Even though we lost, it's way more exciting than any other battle I've ever had till now. Everything's all mixed up inside me. It was just so frustrating and just, yep, it was awesome, really. Because you took it seriously. That's what happens when you take it seriously, man. It's more enjoyable when you take it seriously. Not a motto I go by, honestly. I just prefer to have fun with life. Uh, amazing, you win. Oh, wait, whoop, whoop. It's, it's Kukui, not how. Amazing! You and Hao are both amazing, Dadmo! It's like I told you before, the strongest moves you can use are the ones you and your Pokémon choose together in the heat of the moment, when it really counts. And you just proved yourself right. My s you just proved me right. Congrats, cousin! You're our champion and we can all be proud of it. <laughs> I told you, didn't I? Up in there, Mount Laku Hakulani. Man, the Pokemon and the trainers of Lola really are the best. I want everyone in the world to know that too. That's always been my dream. And right here, right now, it finally came true. And so thanks to you, Dasmo, you and your mark can just mark. No one else. Everyone else can get fucked. Ugh. Man, I need a drink. I need a drink. I was expecting a cutscene to play out there. That was very rude of you to just keep talking to you. I'm so happy I got to see the flaming hot battle here, right where my dreams came true. And now, Dasmo, first ever champion of Alola. I genuinely thought Hal would have been the champion first. I'm sad about it. I didn't want to be the first ever champion of Alola. I want Hal. I want to, I want to dethrone Hal. So what, you just let him walk up to me? You just let Hal walk up to me and battle me right before, right before I'm going to claim my throne? I said... I sat in the throne. I sat in the throne. I was already the champion. I guess that was a, like a, a defense battle? I guess that makes sense. That makes more sense in my head. It's time we recorded you and your beloved team's achievement for eternity. I better see it here. If I come here in like a thousand years time, and you tell me the archives have been destroyed, well you won't tell me, you'll be long gone. And someone tells me the archives have been destroyed, I'm coming for you. You said eternity. You said eternity. Ah, <sighs> oh, the trio you just so. Uh, I, I wish I was paying attention so I could have actually, like, praised my Pokemon individually, but I didn't get to. I didn't get to. <sighs> my boy Sylveon. <gasps> Sad about it. Who's gonna replace Sylveon? Who's gonna replace Sylveon for the post game? I think I know. I think you know. We talked about it. Then again, if I, if I put Rabombi on the team, we've got, a, we've got an overlapping bug typing. And that's just adding to our, our fire weakness. 
Ho hum, ho hum, ho hum. Congratulations, first of a champion of Alola. Oh wow, that's weird. It's weird seeing Moline walk up there instead of Halda. You really did love your Pokemon with all your heart, don't you, Dasbo? Yup, that was precisely why he and his Pokemon were able to combine that strength to emerge victorious. All right, love. Now we're gonna be aiming for your seat. Hope you're ready for some rivals. I already got a rival, and he's a good rival. Come on, Dasbo! Let's go celebrate becoming Alola's first ever champion together with everybody. My old Gramson said we have an awesome party, no matter which one of us won. Oh, it's cute. Why didn't Moline say anything? Do they, can they not be the programming a speech for Moline? All right, Desmond, it's the first you turn from Melly Melly Island. We're gonna have a big festival in Nikki Town. Don't worry, I'm sure to let Lily know too. Uh, we could just not let Lily know. That's fine too. I'm cool with not letting Lily know. Wow, it's the freaking credits. Do we have to go through this this whole thing again? I hated this. <laughs> the, the, the end game cutscenes are just too long for my liking. Is it gonna be the same? It's getting hot in this room, man. It's hot in here. Do we have to do this? <laughs> I'm really hot. It's hot here. I just wanted to leave. I just wanted to stop. Okay, we can skip through this. <gasps> Wait a minute. Whoa. Oh my god, that's awesome! Oh, I like that. I wish I hadn't, like, tried to skip over the ends of the cutscene. Oh, they disbanded Team Skull! Gus was like, no more! And Plumeria's not wearing a Team Skull thing, it's just a normal bandana. Oh, Jesus, they're just gangsters now! Well, I always said, like, they always looked like just gangsters with, uh... Put them- oh, but they still follow Guzma? They're still loyal to Guzma, though? Haha, <laughs> that's cute. I like that way more. Just show that. Oh, these dicks! We did see them. I forgot about them. They're not- they didn't really play a part like they did last time. Like, you don't keep reporting to them. I kind of forgot about them. Uh, Zygod's gonna be first game too, I guess? I don't mind me just readjusting. I was, like, ready to stop. <laughs> oh, shit! There he is! There's the Zygod! He's in a cave somewhere. Where's he at? Where's he at? Where is that? Is that in the- uh, the post-game area? Oh, the Eater Power- oh, we're at the Recon Squad. This is interesting, actually. This is interesting. Post-game content they have here. Well, uh, I mean, end scene content. They're still chilling with Chorus. Is that Farber? Farber's taking over the Ether Paradise, the Ether Foundation. Hmm, suspicious business. Hey, it's everyone. This was a fun series. I enjoyed it. It's not over, by the way. I shouldn't be talking like it's over. Because uh, we're going all the way to post game. This is the first time I've done post game in a lock before. But I'm ready for it because I want to see that rainbow rocket. Why is it her this time? Why? I don't. Ah! Did she just break the fourth wall? Is she a fourth wall break? Ooh, Gladian. Gladian's talking to somebody. Is it Gladian that goes to Cantor this time? Instead of Lily? Oh, is it? I think that's what they're hinting at. I think Gladden's going instead of Lily this time. Because I'm still pretty sure we're going to battle Lily at some point. I see you. I see you, Gladian. Oh, yes, yeah, like everyone coming out to say goodbye. Why aren't we there to say goodbye? Why are we not there? We went out and saw Lily off. We tried to stop her from going. <laughs> same. Same, Gladian. Oh, shit, what up? Are you being- Oh, uh, you came to say goodbye! I'm like, I'm not sure if you're being a douche. Aww, uh, Gladian's smile is so off-putting, but it's also so heartwarming at the same time. Like, it's weird to see, but it's also- Aww, uh, he actually waved. That's all he wanted, that's why he's so edgy, he just wanted a mother to love him! What if that's why Lily went to Kanto? Because, uh... Gladian was there, and we we didn't know that part. And I'm pretty sure- do we see Gladian person game? I don't think we do. Alright, we still have the battle! We still have the battle with the Tapu. Which is a separate encounter, because it's static for one, and it's a new area. Two. Oh, we don't do it this time? Or is he gonna catch us on the way out? I see you. I see you, bitch. 
I see you chilling in there, Tappy Kirker. We don't do it this time. Oh, hello. <laughs> Didn't expect you to be there. Hey, how do we not hear that? How do we not hear that? Come on, he yelled pretty loud. We don't do it this time around. Okay, I'm okay with that. We can do a post game. I will try to get all the tapis as well. I'll try to do all of the, all of the post game content I can. It'll probably be a separate episode. Just what, like what episode where we go to get the tapis? I think. Of course, we got to find out what's up with the rainbow rocket. Why that wasn't part of the main story, I don't know. Screw all the nonsense with uh, the doing the same stuff in Sun and Moon. <sighs> I have a lot of issues with this game, if you can tell. That's the main one. Uh, probably the only one, honestly, now that I'm being honest. Uh, yeah, probably the only one. Too repetitive. Everything else was great. The stuff they added in was awesome. Like, in Sun and Moon were great games on their own. But I just don't think we needed... I think this should have this been the game of ship. This should have been Sun and Moon. In my opinion, this should have been Sun and Moon. Actually, no. I take it back. Retract that statement. This should have been one game. That would have made it perfect for me. This should have been Eclipse. This should have been Pokemon Eclipse. But no, they made it two versions, and we it wasn't needed. All they needed to do was put all, all the legends in the wormholes in one game. Put them all there instead of breaking them up into two. Rainbow Rocket, same stuff. Bring in, like, all the, all the, all the totems that Oak gives you. Put them all in one thing. That would've been fine. Maybe, excuse me, maybe change up the first one. Obviously, gotta change the first trial because it's different based on the game, but... that That's the main thing that bothered me, and it's a huge thing. Like, I don't like money grabs, but... I don't know, it just seems a bit tacky, like, not finishing up. Because this was officially the last game, the last 3DS games. The last Pokemon 3DS games. For, uh... For the 3DS, as you are probably aware. Uh, so... I think it's a bit tacky not wrapping up with one game and doing two. Have one concise ending. Whatever, that's just my nitpicks. That is just my nitpicks with the game. I didn't read any of that because, uh... It's not important, they just praise me for being champion. Cheers to that, am I right? Come on, this Oh, hi, hi mom. Forgot you existed, honestly. Ah, you're positively glowing. Uh, oh, what are you staring at? What was that? Oh, you're gonna... Like a firework? What happened? Why was that... What do you do? Whip his dick out and they all cheered? I'm confused. Why did it go... Why did it pan up? I want to see what he did. Maybe that was explained. That mean the thing that I skipped. Oh, more credits. Neato. Fade to black and then what? Fade to black and then what? What happens when you fade to black? Hey, there we go. I'm coming home. I'm coming on home. Coming on. I just realized my 3DS is not plugged in. Really? He's going to play the credits on me? I waited. I waited in the heat for you to play something. Wow. I was waiting for a post credit scene. Like, this is exactly how I felt at the end of Spider-Man Homecoming. You know that post credit scene where Chris Evans is like, patience. Sometimes... It's not worth having patience, or however it goes. I forget. I forget how it goes. Saving. I guess we're done. I guess we're done then. Alright. I guess we're done. Alright, so, that's the end of the main story, at least, but the series is far from over. Ladies and g g gentlemen. Uh, yes. Like I said, I'm gonna be doing the first game. Because I want to face them rainbow rockets. I want to see what that's all about. I'm not even this far in my personal playthrough on Moon. So I just want to keep going. I'm gonna keep going and do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, yeah. Honestly, the, the the Rainbow Rocket part is like the part that everyone's been looking forward to, so I don't know why I wouldn't do it. And I don't know why I have to put anyway. Like I said, I've had my issues with this game. We'll continue it back on in the next episode. Uh, I'm probably gonna go back to doing one episode a day so I can upload other things as well. Does he always run like a rainbow like that? Anyway. Anyway, with that being done, we are gonna call this an episode. It's not a series. That's why it felt weird. It felt it feel weird to like sit through the sit through the credits and talk about the series as a whole, like I usually do. But it's not the end of the series, actually. I'm gonna have to do the first bit because I'm gonna have to rearrange the team when I come back. When I come back to this way, Tapu Dasmo. No, that would what? That's about why? What? <laughs> I'm not a Tapu mate. How dare you? How dare you? 
All right, so I just need to do this little this little bit first because I need to rearrange the team between episodes. Looks like you slept well, Dazzler. <laughs> That's champion Dazzler to you. Ah, Lola. The sad wait, pff, silly voice. The sad to be sang me and brought me to you to you. So Lily didn't leave this time around. It was Gladian. What? Sparkle, sparkle. Ah, that there's a Cantoni meow. Look at that shiny coin on your cat, kitty cat. Meow. The fuck? This guy's talking about my coin. That's rude. Uh, by the way, there are some pretty interesting people looking for you too, Dasmo. So let's get out. Is it gonna be Looker again? And the champion Lola doesn't get to just stay inside all day. The champion Lola does what the fuck he wants, mate. He does whatever he wants. So I think that's it. I think that is... You mean outside outside? Like directly outside my house? Oh. It's just Rick and Morty. No big deal. Uh, jeez. Hey there, Dasmo. We got some coming champion. Uh, they're doing the trial too, right? They said they're gonna they're gonna do the trial. So that means they're gonna take me on. They're gonna want to take me on eventually. Uh, I haven't quite figured out what the champion is, but you're very strong, correct? I have a favorite. I must ask you. Ultra beasts have appeared. I'm pony. Really? We're doing this again? They must have come through the ultra wormhole created by Necrozma. And being the champion means you're st uh, ah, jeez. I mean, the champion means you're stronger than the other Kahuna, right? Me and the center are all gonna go too. He's pretty strong too. Just take him. He's fine. He put in work. He's good. Just take him. We, we're busy. We got Rainbow Rocket to deal with. We're good. Uh, of course, you two are the finest trainers in all the I know it said best. I know it said best. Don't don't pull me up on it. We are heading to Pony Island now. Would you like to accompany us? Sure. Why the hell not? Why the hell not? Ancient Pony Path, we're back, but we ch- Alright. This area. Alright, we'll continue this in the next episode. Yeah, of course we have Sylveon and Cloister to replace. I don't know who I'm gonna replace him with, but that'll be interesting. I said I needed a water type. Now I can get a water type that isn't neutral to fire, I suppose. Oh yeah, with that being done, we are gonna go ahead and call the episode. If you did enjoy this episode, make sure you like and leave a comment and know what you thought of the chapter. Balbon, so it's out of the thing. In the next episode, I think we're gonna go back and do like all the side stuff that I missed and then we might tackle the post game. We'll see. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Okay, but until next episode, Alola. <laughs>